family. Welcome to season one, episode seven of Wow Wednesday. We are halfway through the week and I pray this word blesses and encourages you. Today's word comes from Psalm chapter 51, verses one to 12. Have mercy on me, O God, according to your unfailing love, according to your great compassion. Blot out my transgressions, wash away all my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. For I know my transgressions and my sin is always before me. Against you, you only have I sinned and done what is evil in your sight. So you are right in your verdict and justified when you judge. Surely I was sinful at birth, sinful from the time my mother conceived me. Yet you desired faithfulness even in the womb. You taught me wisdom in that secret place. Cleanse me with hyssop and I will be clean. Wash me and I will be whiter than snow. Let me hear joy and gladness. Let the bones you have crushed rejoice. Hide your face from my sins and blot out all my iniquity. Create in me a pure heart, O God, and renew a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me from your presence or take your Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of your salvation and grant me a willing spirit to sustain me. This was a prayer that King David prayed in the Bible. Can you hear the vulnerability through his words to God? (laughs) I definitely see why God called David the man after his own heart. Even when David fell into sin many times, (laughs) he still turned back to the Lord who was his source of life. When our prayers lack vulnerability and honesty, they lack power. Prayer is supposed to be a time where we pour our hearts out to God. God wants you to bring your fears, pain, anger, and struggles to his presence and leave the fear and guilt at the door. Sometimes our awareness that we have sinned and have fallen short causes us not to pray because we think we are unworthy of God. And sometimes we think we have sinned so much that God wouldn't even listen to us ever again. This feeling of guilt keeps us from being completely vulnerable and transparent when we pray. And worse, this guilt has caused so many people from praying at all. The thing is, God wants your utmost transparency and vulnerability. Prayer is supposed to be honest conversations between you and God. God knows and sees everything, even the things that you want to remain hidden. Hopefully this reality would allow you to break down your guilt wall and pour everything out onto God like David did in the Bible. My prayer is that you will be completely honest with God and pray with complete vulnerability. God knows everything about us and he still loves us, flaws and all. I pray you are blessed and encouraged by this word. Have a blessed week, family, and see you next week for another Wow Wednesday. (laughs) Stay blessed and stay worded.